New at 10 tonight, we take a close look at some of the most dangerous streets in St. Louis for pedestrians. A report from Trailnet shows a large percentage of fatalities are happening on a small number of those streets. Fox News Jeff Bernthal joins us now from Midtown with a closer look at that report, Jeff. One of those streets highlighted Grand Boulevard, south from where we are, multiple crashes involving cyclists to the north, deadly crashes involving pedestrians. It is what Trailnet calls a high crash corridor. Grant is a busy boulevard. Plenty of cars and plenty of pedestrians. So I just see a lot of people speeding past, especially at night and through red lights and making lefts on red lights, so that's obviously very dangerous. St. Louis-based nonprofit Trailnet analyzed crash data in St. Louis City and County from 2021. More people are getting killed and more people are getting injured in crashes in the region. Among Trailnet's findings, 45% of all fatal crashes involving pedestrians in the city of St. Louis occurred on just seven roads. Grand, Gravoy, Broadway, Natural Bridge, Kings Highway, Page, and Dr. Martin Luther King Drive. So we want to see elected officials and local transportation officials making decisions that are improving the health and safety of people on our streets. In St. Louis County, Trailnet's report found 50% of pedestrian fatalities occurred on just four roads, West Florissant, Page, Lindbergh, and Chambers. The report did find some good news. We saw some improvements in the region, some greater investment in people-focused infrastructure, whether it's sidewalk improvements, protected bike lanes. We've reported on the ongoing efforts by St. Louis police to focus traffic enforcement initiatives on high crash areas. The nonprofit Trailnet hopes its report shines more light on where improvements can be made. A lot of these crashes are preventable, and by looking at the size of a street, um, the speed of the traffic along that street, uh, policymakers and decision makers at the city and county level can make improvements to reduce deaths and reduce fatalities. Trailnet also finding a disproportionately high number of crashes taking place in black minority communities here in the St. Louis area. You can read the full report at fox2now.com. Again, Trailnet believes the way some of these streets are designed goes a long way to keeping those who use them safe. Reporting live from Midtown tonight, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.